from the Cardio 13 investigates team. There's currently an arrest warrant out for people in charge of Maggie's Farm, a popular marijuana business in southern Colorado. This decision linked to them failing to pay a security company over $350,000 for work at a Maggie's Farm location in Manatee Springs and also two in Pueblo. Cardio 13 investigator Sean Rice is live to explain the latest chapter in the financial saga for Maggie's Farm. Sean. Yeah, Heather, the CEO, CFO, and managing partners of Maggie's Farm were ordered to pay in court, show up in court this morning to respond to allegations that they failed to pay a security company $353,000. They were a no-show today, which led El Paso County Judge David Gilbert to issue a warrant for their arrest. None of Maggie's Farm's representatives showed up at the hearing. Attorney Greg Givens was the only person in the courtroom with Judge David Gilbert Friday, even though a judge ordered the owners of Maggie's Farm to be there too. Givens represents Raven Security Group. The security group was hired to work at three Maggie's Farms locations in Manitou Springs and Pueblo. But six months into the contract, they allege Maggie's Farm stopped paying them. They've had to scramble to move money around and to make sure that uh, their contractors are being paid because they had to pay their their security contractors and but Maggie's refused to pay them. After attempts to settle the case out of court were met with silence, Raven Security Group filed a lawsuit. A few days later, the judge ordered Maggie's farm to pay up to three hundred and fifty eight thousand dollars money that to this day has never been paid. Instead of dialing back its operations and, and scaling, you know, according to, you know, business needs, Maggie's kept, you know, its <laughs> current operation. Yeah. And as a result, as, as a consequence, it failed to pay my client for its security services and also other, there are, I know there are other vendors who have not been paid as well. The arrest warrants could lead to jail time if Maggie's farm continues to be in contempt of court for failing to respond to these allegations. I don't want any criminal proceedings entered against these people. I just want to find out where their assets are, you know, but if we need to take the next step, Raven Security is fully prepared to take those next steps. And today I spoke with Maggie's Farm CEO Bill Conkling. He sounded seemingly surprised and unaware that there was even a warrant for his arrest. He said we'd be hearing from his attorney for comment, but we're still awaiting that comment. Reporting live in studio, Sean Rice, Cardio 13 Investigates. All right, Sean, thank you.